For the last uh, three years, we've collaborated very closely with the National Pancreas Foundation. Um, the National Pancreas Foundation was established in 1997 as a charitable organization by uh, Patter Brissick in uh, Pittsburgh. And, and what, what their purpose has been is basically to tackle the entire pancreas patient, tackling the patient who has chronic pancreatitis, acute pancreatitis, and pancreatic malignancy. Um, they are the only organization in the country that really looks at all three of those um, aspects of the patient care. Um, and provides research dollars to you know, help fund a little bit of the research models and, and trying to cure these patients, especially with these more chronic malignancies. The good part about it is that in the last year, they've, they've been able to identify centers throughout the country that do this in a multidisciplinary way, in a rigorous fashion. Um, that's, again, different than hospitals that only have one piece of the puzzle taken care of. So um, in September of this year, after a rigorous audit, um, we were dedicated the first National Pancreas Foundation Center of Excellence in New Jersey. Um, and that's, again, it's a testament to our team that we have here that takes care of the patient as a whole patient, as opposed to individual pieces that other institutions may do well. There are 30 in the, 30 in the country. Um, in this area, basically, we're, again, we're the only one in New Jersey. We, um, in the tri-state area, Columbia Presbyterian is another institution that's part of this. Um, Johns Hopkins was the first, and, uh, and we certainly joined a list of very prestigious organizations in pancreas care. What sets us apart is that we really can take care of the whole pancreas patient, and that's really what, what drove us to getting that designation here. Um, we have you know, expert surgeons who can take care of pancreas problems. We have uh, very good pancreas oncologists who are very dedicated to the care of the pancreas cancer patient. We have top-notch nutritional service that can really take care of the nutritional aspects as we discussed, pain management, Without a doubt, we are very, very um, abreast of the field in taking care of it. Dr. Contreras in our pain management center um, does a very good job of taking care of these patients. Um, and certainly the gastroenterologic expertise to, to take care of the problems as they arise, the cysts in the pancreas, the diagnosis of the early chronic pancreatitis patients, and more importantly, the identification of the malignant patients. It's a lar largely based on our education. We, we get out there and we, we basically talk to the um, affiliated hospitals, the nearby hospitals, that each region has um, a nearby pancreas center of excellence. Uh, again, the pancreas is complex enough and the diseases of the pancreas are rare enough that they're best managed in a multidisciplinary center as opposed to individually by other places. Certainly lots of hospitals in the area can do Whipple procedures, procedures on the pancreas um, that are surgical, but best managed in a multidisciplinary center. It uh, plays a big role. I, you know, I, I, uh, it's become a passion of mine over the last 17 years to, to treat pancreas cancer patients. And it's, and it's a very um, tough job, obviously. Pancreas cancer is um, not certainly one of the um, easier malignancies to manage. Um, there are some novel oncologic regimens for it, but still it remains a very difficult cancer to treat, um, still with a 5% five-year mortality, 5% uh, five five-year survival. So it's, it's a tough cancer. But because there are so many aspects to it, we can really make the patients um, better. You know, we, if we're not necessarily trying to cure them in the majority, we certainly are palliating quite well. So uh, that, that's what drew me to it. Again, there's, there's so many different things that we can do for the patients um, who have pancreas cancer that really sets us apart from any other institution um, that really makes the patient's lives overall better. It's funny, we, uh, you know, my wife is an oncologist, so we, we have very interesting conversations at night. I do a lot of GI oncology work. The only thing I don't do is give chemotherapy. Everything else, we manage the pain, we manage the uh, complications as they arise. Um, so certainly we work very closely and hand in hand with the oncologic service here. Um, and oftentimes you can imagine the, you know, the, the patient care is tantamount.